So this is the Headspace sampler. It's connected to the GC, to the inlet, using this transfer line. This transfer line is insulated in foam. There's actually a thin steel capillary that goes from inside the auto sampler to the inlet. Here's the what the auto sampler looks like. Um, it's got a 12 position carousel. And what will happen is the vials will be moved from inside the carousel. We pushed up inside this component here of the headspace sampler. They'll be heated to a certain temperature uh, and then they will get transferred into the inlet. And so we open up the top here. You can see that the transfer line connects into the inlet port. You can kind of tell that it's going in there. So it, with um, we have a, a special device here that keeps the headspace and the auto sampler connected at the same time, which is a very nice feature. Um, so we can't run headspace and liquid samples simultaneously or within the same uh, method really, or sequence really. Um, but we can, we don't have to worry about switching out the inlet ports and things like that. So uh, it's a really nice uh, setup now. So to put the vials in the auto sampler, you simply uh, find the position that you want to put it in. I want to put the vial in sample one, but I don't see it right now. So I'm going to push uh, tray, park, carousel, advance on the front of the headspace sampler. And that rotates the carousel so that now I can see where position one is. So I can just place my vial in there. 